Oh, what's up guys welcome back to my youtube channel i am beauty lux as you know what's up y'all i feel like it's been a while um i am back with this glass skin routine i wanted to show you guys what i do what i use because so many of you asked me like what i use on my skin or you gave me compliments on my skin which i'm very thankful for i'm very humble i appreciate all your comments all your likes all your subscribing thank you so much y'all my nods video y'all went crazy on that video and i am just i am just beside myself i'm so happy so thank you so much um yeah i'm gonna show you guys how i achieve this glass like skin if you guys are interested in seeing how i achieve this look keep okay, so we are going to jump right into the video um today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how i get my glass like skin uh, honey because uh, she was a mess for a little while and then all of a sudden you know i started doing my regimen again and then um i started noticing that my skin was getting a lot better so this is kind of like my first self-care sunday um that I'm getting ready with you guys or whatever, doing my little makeup and everything. I am wearing my Lemire robe, as you guys can see, and my Lemire headband. I was gifted this from my job, but I never got to use it. So I was like, when I do my first like skincare video, I'm gonna wear it. It's very comfortable. Um, it's a warm robe for sure. Um, but um, yes, I feel like I'm in a spa, so I appreciate that. And so um, I'm gonna be showing you guys how I get this beautiful glass glowy skin. Um, we are gonna start off with my cleanser. Um, I do use an ex I do sometimes like to exfoliate before I cleanse, but the exfoliator that I have, um, I just found out that it's not that great for the skin, so I kind of stopped using it. And how I found that out is through this app called Yuka. So this is the app right here, that little carrot right there, that one right there, that little carrot right there. Um, you download that app and it will. you can scan anything and it'll tell you what something is like, what it's not like. I don't even think I have anything around for me to scan that I, um, I think I was, I started throwing stuff away once I found out that, you know, the stuff wasn't no good anymore or what, that's really bad for your skin. Cause I've been trying to go on this journey of, you know, like just doing it all clean. Um, so that wasn't going to work for me so i started throwing stuff away but anyway i found replacements for them some of them and some of them is my stuff that i use all the time um so i'm going to be starting off with my cleanser and the cleanser that i'm going to be starting off with today is the chanel number no. one which is pronounced chanel number no. uh, in france so um this is their red camellia line and just so you guys know chanel has went clean with this entire line um this entire line is clean i do have this the serum the eye cream um i've been using it i absolutely love it it's it, it, my skin feels great when i do use it um this is a powdered cleanser kind of like the dermalogica i think it's dermalogica has this um who else has one uh good molecules has one as well so this is what the bottle looks like and this is what the top looks like and so what we're gonna do is i'm gonna just twist the top you have to twist the top if you can see me okay you're gonna twist the top and you're gonna pour some of the powder in your hand like this I'll be OD on the powder but you know gotta get the face clean so after you the powder you're gonna add some water to it so I have some water here I'm gonna add to it just so I can get my skin get it together so that you guys can see exactly what it looks like on the skin and again I'm adding more water and so I don't want it to like dry up or whatever, but this is the foam you get from this. I I love it. I think it's great. Um, my skin has been looking and feeling amazing. Why is it? Okay. Looking and feeling amazing with this. Um, all you have to do is just, well, if you're in the bathroom, you're going to keep adding my, again, I told y'all it's a long story, but anyway. So, I'm just moisturizing this all into my skin with some water and yeah i'm loving this right now i've been loving it for the past couple days i've been trying it out i used to use the Lemus um face wash but then i scanned it and it's not that great so i figured this line is good let me go ahead and get this and you guys will see you see how it's how it suds up on the face 
how it gets the skin, how milky it gets, and this is a powder. And so I'm going to go and I'm going to wash this off my face and I will be right back to show you guys how my skin looks after I wash this particular face wash off. Okay? Have that. <laughs> okay. I'm back <laughs> as you can see I washed um, the face wash off my face and my skin feels great I love it I've always been a Chanel um, skincare person I used to use Chanel for a very long time and then I stopped and I started using a whole bunch of other stuff and like just incorporating different things into my regimen wanted to see how it would you know what my skin would do and it was fine I've, I've never really had problems skin I'm just gonna be honest my entire life I never really had problems skin um, Acne was never really a big thing for me. I have some um, acne like around when it's time for my period to come or something like that. But it'll be like one or two. Like I had these one, two, three little spots up here that I was picking because I wasn't used to it. Or if I get stressed out, I'll get like I'll have breakouts and I try not to do that anymore. I haven't been having any breakouts, so that must mean I'm not stressed out. So that's good. So now I'm going to be going in with my toner because again like I said I don't have an exfoliant to use I did have this exfoliant right here and this is the vitamin vitamins and C beauty sea salt coconut gentle and brightening face scrub but I scanned it and it doesn't have the best properties in it so I'm gonna stop using this or whatever money down the drain but um, I'm going to go ahead and use my toner what I'm gonna be using I mean you know what I mean. Get my toner. Um, I'm going to be using my Shiseido Facial Cotton. I don't really, I don't usually use the Shiseido Cotton often. Um, I get them if I see them at like TJ Maxx or whatever. But I am very much a Clay Depot Chanel girl when it comes to the cotton rounds. They come in the box. They're about $25 a box. So I've been using those for years. I love those cotton rounds. And I buy them like two at a time. So I don't run out, but unfortunately I ran out. So I have my shade on one, so I'm going to be using this to use with my Good Molecules Niacinamide Brightening Toner. Good Molecule, honey, is taking over. They are having some of the best products that's out there on the market, and they work. It's not over expensive. I really like this um, toner because it doesn't leave my skin with any texture. And so that's good as we go through the day. So I'm just going to show you guys I'm wiping off my face with this um, toner just really getting in there wiping stuff off making sure that I get everything that does not belong on my skin off of my skin and just really going in there like really going in there with it and yesterday I did not wear any makeup to work but look at that your face is never too clean so i recommend that you get a toner this one is a brightening toner so it's going to um reduce the dullness in the skin it makes the skin look a lot brighter um i just like this toner a lot it's just um it's simple it's not a lot of stuff going on with it it's not a whole bunch of ingredients and if you scan this on that app it's 100 out of 100 so that works for me i i've been using this one actually and the glycolic one for about six months now so i really really like these so while my skin i just did that to my skin i'm gonna prep the rest of my skin but i'm gonna put my eye patches on just because i like to moisturize under my eyes before i do um everything else so i'm going in with and i know that you guys have seen this line online i went and bought the whole collection of it because it is just that good i'm sorry everybody knows that if you go to uh japan korea they have some of the best skincare this advanced snail peptide eye cream the, i have the eye cream i have the essence i have the cream but we're gonna get into all of that but honey this line is amazing it is made with 92 percent a 92 percent a snail secretion so that helps with tightening firming plumping the skin you know that if you go to korea you can go ahead and get a snail um facial and they just let the snails just rolling over your face and just plump up your skin and pull the blood and circulate to the front of the skin which is an awesome idea so what I like to do is I'll take this and I put some under this eye here 
make sure it's nice and saturated and then I'll put some of this on here my routine is very fast it's very quick I don't do a whole bunch of stuff um, I do have couple of gadgets that I do use on my skin but not too much be just because like I said I've never had problem skin I don't see anything hanging or creasing or wrinkles or anything like that so I don't feel like it's any need for me to use half of the stuff that I have I just be having it to have it it's whatever so I'm gonna go in with my Chanel eye patches and I just let that sit on there for like five minutes I let the patches sit on there for about five minutes. I probably go brush my teeth or something like that. And you know, if I didn't do that already, I already brushed my teeth. I'm like, you know. So I would let this sit on for about five minutes, go brush my teeth, do whatever I'm doing, whatever, whatever. I already told my skin it's not dry or anything like that. So that's good. And then I'll take this off after five minutes and then we'll get into the rest of the video. But I do want to show y'all my cup. I was having some tea while I was doing this and I put it there and it's probably cold at this point by now. But this is my cup. Isn't this cute? It says Gemini right there. And this is the spoon to the cup. And so you don't have to worry about like putting your cup on the side of your your um coaster or or the side of your saucer where you could keep your your um cup. You don't have to worry about that. It can go right on the cup and it just sits there just like that and it is just super cute. I will definitely leave a link below with um the deets on this cup and that spoon so you guys can order one for yourself cuz I know y'all going to want one cuz it's cute and y'all need it. So yeah. So I'm just going to let this sit for like another two minutes and I will be right back once I take these. Okay, I am back and we are going to take off our patches now. And whatever cream is on, like whatever is, the patches actually, they come with a serum as well. I ran out of the serum like the other day and so I just never went and got another one. And so it's just like super... It feels tight, like like it's tightening my skin, which is the whole meaning of doing all this. <laughs> so it feels great. My skin feels great. It doesn't feel tight. It doesn't feel dry or anything like that. So after I use my eye cream, I go in with a serum. Rather, excuse me, not the serum. I go in with my essence because I did not put my essence on. So I am, again, using the Advanced Snail 96 Mucin, Mucin Power Essence. This essence is amazing. It feels so good on my skin. And what I do with this is I just take like two pumps of it. I kind of rub it together and I just press it into my skin. I don't ever like just rub stuff into my skin. Because I hate that. Just because I feel like I'm taking all the product off if I do that. Like, I feel like you just put it on your hands and now you're just rubbing it all over the place. So, I just press that into my skin. It gets a little sticky when you first put it in, but then when it dries down, it's just like, oh, it is phenomenal. So, I love that. So, after I do that, I do, I have been recently, since it's allergy season, every year I get a bad sinus infection. I haven't had one yet, so I'm hoping that things are changing in my life right now. So, but my skin, it does get like this little irritation, it's like this weird little irritation thing that happens to my skin. And so, um, I will use my La Mer Concentrate. And with this concentrate, I love this because it was made for, you know, La Mer's products were made for people like burn victims, things like that. That's why the cream is so thick. And so, um, with this concentrate, it helps with, like, soothing any burns, any scratches, anything that you have, like, any physical, um, scarring or something on the skin. That's what this does. It helps with that. So, this is the Lamia Concentrate. If you guys have never seen this before, but I'm sure you have. So, I just take a little bit on the spatula on the back of my hand, and I just put it where I feel the, like, annoying little burny kind of feeling in my skin so which would be like around my nose area I put it there and I just bring it all into my skin here and guys I literally I mean this I don't do every day only if I feel it 
in my skin and i have been feeling it in my skin for the past couple days so that's what i've been using it for and right here in this centerpiece i don't know why it feels like this burning sensation sometimes like right here and i'm just like what is that and so i put that there that's that's that other than that, I use my that Lamia sparingly. I use it when I need to use it. I don't use it when I like it. It's just like, oh, let me just go use that. No, it's not it's not a serum for me or anything like that. So that's fine. Then after that, I go in with my serum. And my serum is the Chanel, the Revitalizing Serum, the Red Camellia Revitalizing Serum. And so this is the red line. Again, this line is all clean. So with this serum, this serum helps with wrinkles, fighting fine lines, um, firming tightening um just um putting elasticity back into the collagen in your skin it just helps with everything i really like it it's not sticky it doesn't have like a crazy smell to it it actually smells like camellia so fun fact camellia um the camellia plant or flower rather they have twenty seven thousand of them in the world and so chanel sourced out the red one for this particular line and it's been 10 years in the making and they finally went clean and brought this to us so i was super excited about that because like i said i'm a long time chanel um skincare user so i was happy that they went clean with some of the things that they use or whatever so yeah i'm excited about that so this is the serum this is what it looks like and this is how you twist the top and this is going to pop up right here on the side here it's going to pop up and you twist it off and it has a squeeze in every single dropper that's a whole face full what you need to put on your face so i just drop that right in the palm of my hand and it's not a big like a glop of it it's just like enough you can't even see it because it's clear but i just rub that together and again i press that into my skin as well it smells divine it smells like you know like chanel camellia it smells great I just press that in my skin and yeah loving this stuff so that's that and then you i go i go a little bit old school on them y'all a little bit old school on them so what i do is i take my moisturizer which is the advanced now all-in-one it's the all-in-one cream y'all i'm telling you right now this line I seen you know, I seen somebody post I think it was the essence on TikTok and I went and I got the essence and after that I was like I'm going to get everything because it just my skin has never felt this soft like in a long time I have been going through different products like this stuff is amazing I really really like it okay so this is the, the this is the moisturizer to the essence I used and to the eye cream I used and this is the advanced Snell 92 all-in-one face cream by Corsex and it is formulated with 92% Snell secretion um, this cream helps naturally create the appealing glow of healthy skin and that's exactly what it does my skin looks so good with this moisturizer I love it it's it's like a tacky sticky feel when you first put it on but once it dries down it is just absolutely phenomenal i love it it feels so good on my skin um i have no complaints the whole line is just amazing to me if you get a chance to go down to any i think ulta sells it i got it from ulta so i know ulta sells it i don't think that sephora sells it but you can order it online too this line is so good y'all i'm telling you my skin looks like it's best since i've been using it so when you look ah! I'm such a kid when it comes to stuff like that. So, you take a little. You don't need a lot either. Just take a little. I put it in the palm of my hand, just like that. And when you do that, look. <laughs> I'm stupid. So I put that into my skin like this, and I just make sure I press everything into my skin, and just press it into the skin so that it doesn't i just feel like if you when you start rubbing stuff it start feeling like you just rubbing it and rubbing it and rubbing it it's like you rub it off and so i just press that into my skin and look you can see how how good the skin looks just by just that's it that's it it just 
it's like it's like it's best but then i have another little because of these dark marks that i have up here i use something else on my skin that um really helps with my skin i don't know if people know about this oil it's called umi, umi oil and this is it is 100 percent pure umi oil i used this before when i had gotten some dark marks on my skin here and it immediately faded it out took it off because i try to use as much natural stuff as i possibly can but i'm not gonna hold y'all i still be using my stuff you know it's whatever you gotta try new stuff and i would get bored if i just kept using the same stuff all the time it just doesn't make any sense so i'm not you know whatever so i use this oil and I mix it with vitamin E oil, which is 100% pure vitamin E oil, which we know gets rid of dark scarring, helps to heal skin. If you have any aggravation in the skin, any inflammation in the skin, vitamin E oil is definitely going to do that. So what I do with this is I take like one, two, three, four drops of the vitamin E oil. Oops, that's running down. I take like four drops of the vitamin E oil. And this is what's been, ha and this is like one of the secrets to why my skin has been looking the way it's been looking. And then I drop like one, two, three, four, yeah, four drops of the Umi oil as well. I mix them together in the palm of my hands, rub it, and then I just put it all over my skin. By the time it's time for you to do your makeup, your face, your um, by the, to do your makeup, your skin should have soaked up most of this and absorbed it in but i'm telling you now my skin has been in its best form with this routine that i've been doing i swear to god it's been in its best form and it's just like people have been asking me like what are you wearing what are you using on your skin and i'm like yeah i don't know it's a couple of steps but it's just like this this works for me this works for me it makes me feel like makes my skin feel good it makes me feel good that i know that i'm putting all of this natural clean stuff into my skin at that so that works too but like i said before i still use my stuff y'all y'all yeah, gonna see another skincare video with the other stuff that i use i use a ton of different things but this is the one that i'm using right now as of now i'm probably gonna switch this up in six months because also if you don't know your skin will um get used to certain products and it probably and it doesn't work as effective as it you know how it should have worked when you first started it it's just like oh okay my skin's like this and then you start feeling like oh i need a new something to you know use on my skin so that's why i switch up my skin routine every six months or whatever the case may be so yeah this is why <sighs> this skin honey so this is what my skin looks like with everything on it i try not to do too much to it and by the time it's time for me to put my makeup on that's why i have a flawless application and i'm gonna tell anybody this if you want flawless makeup if you want to be able to do that makeup no makeup look and your skin is just like flawless this is what you're gonna have to do you're gonna have to take care of your skin um i've been trying my best to cut out candy to cut out because i love sweets i love cakes i love cookies i love sweets I've been trying my best to cut out all of those things and I have been cutting them out slowly but surely. I'm the type of person, I don't have an addictive personality, so when it's done, it's done. When you're over, you're over. So that's that on that. And so, um, yeah. So after I do this, I'm obsessed with my like under eye. I never wanted to get dark. I never wanted to do nothing crazy. I go in with the um Chanel number one the eye cream and that's the camellia eye cream as well and i just put a, i just dab a little bit of this on the um shit yeah like i said i just take a little bit of the chanel um the revitalizing eye cream and this helps with deep puffiness brightens under the eye all that good stuff this is what it looks like um if you guys can see i don't know if you can see right so i just take like a little dab of it y'all i do not go crazy with it because i already put on the eye cream but i just take a dab of this and i just put it under the eye area here and i take that and i bring that all the way up to my lids and it'll penetrate onto the whole eye area i just take a little because again remember i'm going to be putting on concealer to do my makeup so 
I always like my under eye to be hydrated. I am so, I do not want black circles. I do not want no crazy wrinkles. If and when that, if the, if and when that should ever happen, I hopefully, I will have the money to Botox that bitch up. No, let me stop. Hopefully I can age gracefully and I don't have to get none of that shit done. But, you know, whatever. We never know. So, after I do all of that, face is done. Everything is hydrated. We look great. Our skin looks amazing. I go in with my Winky Lux. It's this watermelon little scrub here. And I just scrub my lips because my lips, I, honey, these lips, my lips, I don't play with it. My lips I don't play with at all. Not like not not for one moment. So I put the scrub on and I found this when I was, you know, you always find a little stuff when you out shopping and going about or whatever. This is a daily lip scrubber. So it looks like this. You just put it on your finger and it looks like this, and you take it and you fuck your scrub in there. Uh huh. If people think that it's like super abrasive, it's not. I'm just gonna take one of my um, Shiseido swatches here and um, just wipe off any excess of the little sugar that was on there. Yeah. Now my lips are nice and scrubbed and plump. Oh, oh, scrubbed and plumped. And then, last but not least, I go in with my. If you know me, you already know, baby. I run through these like water. Don't ever play with it. I love these, but baby, this is it for my lips. I have this one. I have this one. I have a four pack in storage that I just. I cannot live without this stuff. I'm sorry. It just makes my lips feel like it's the best thing ever. My lips look, ugh. They feel so good when you put this on. It just feels so good. Like, I just, that's it. Well, that is the end of my skincare routine and what I've been using lately. Um yeah i would have to say this is pretty much a glass look honey she's really really together so yeah my hair is a mess y'all had to wash it and it just it's a mess but i'm gonna figure out something to do to it but yeah so this is my skin i'm gonna leave everything linked below um in the description box so you guys can go ahead and try it out for yourself um if you guys have any questions if you want to know anything about any type of skincare just don't ever feel like you can't just hit me up in the subscription box you can message me you can do whatever let me know email me whatever but don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my videos because we building a community and i need y'all okay i need y'all i want to continue to give y'all content consistent content i know it's been a while since i've been out and about or whatever um but it's like if it, i'll be trying to figure out what kind of content to put out and how i should be putting out the content so i'm getting there and so hopefully it's going to start being consistent on a consistent basis i want to at least throw out at least two videos a week for you guys so that you know you can get the ball rolling for real for real and so i'm not gonna be saying that either in every video just so y'all know <laughs> all right so thank you guys for tuning in again i am forever thankful and um yes i will see you guys in the next video bye